We're back in the White House. Night has fallen, your enemies have not. Let's go. So it's dark. Where though? Where are you? Is that bush shooting at me? Yeah, it was. Wow, this gun is loud. <laughs> I like games that make guns loud. It seems more realistic than having a gun that's super quiet. Oh god. It's something about night vision that makes games just look really crummy. Staring at everything through monochromatic green. These guys are very good shots. He's dead. Wait for the shout. Ah, TV Cauldron are back. They're my favourite TV station. Hey! This all you have left from your detail? This is it. We're down to the wire. Reinforcements are coming from across the way, but they're anticipating a major attack any minute now. They could use your gun. What about you? We've held on this long. Besides, if they get through you guys, it's the Alamo here anyway. I think this cutscene could have used a little bit more lighting. All right, tell them I'm coming so I don't get shot by friendly fire. Which way? Cut through the Rose Garden to the doors at the base of the central building. Good luck, Pierce. All right, we're on our, on our route again. But I can't see where I'm going. It's too dark. Oh, the open door. That'd be. <laughs> All right. Gunfight here. Yep. Yeah. Oh, lots of gunfight. Grenade. Those grenades look really wonky when you throw them. It's a shame they can see me through the shrubbery. Do we think it does a snapping Call of Duty thing? Or I just keep pressing the left trigger enough? I reckon there's still a guy down here, but... Nope, it's quiet. What's that? Ah, cell phones, yes! Remember when we were collecting cell phones? Did they cut the power in this building? Come all the way up the stairs to the roof. Fall off? Got too far. You must be related ha. to Agent Doyle. I'll be right there. I did look this up. That is Nolan North, by the way. <laughs> when I said it sounded like Nolan North, it is Nolan North. I don't know how much they spent to get Nolan North, because he's a he's a pretty big talent, and especially at this era he like he'd done uncharted at this point so he was the hot ticket oops no pick that up again that, that weapon's loud and it's got a scope on it welcome to the sniper's nest pierce easy rules up here keep your night vision goggles on shoot anything down below and two legs that gets too close to the building yeah, including animals oh yeah keep your arms legs and head inside the ride at all times or they'll get blown off <laughs> Me sniper. Well, it's giving me very little space to work with. Right, where are we going? Who? Who? I can't see anybody. Are these three guys down here? I was going to say the night vision doesn't make it much different, but it does. 
Can't see a thing. Is there smoke? Not so much one shot, one killers. Three shots, occasional kill. Where are you? Can I shoot him through the... Yes, I can. Okay. This might be the easy way of doing it, because... There's too many of them to fight head on. I see you! I love how he tells you to keep your night vision goggle on, but there's a battery that means that you genuinely can't. Oh, thank you for shouting that twice. Oop. Where are you? They all seem to stand in the same six places. Anymore? You're a hell of a marksman. I know. Because <laughs> I'm a hell of a marksman. Anyway, we appreciate the trigger finger. Go through this door. One floor down to the rest of our detail. I'll cover you. Thank me later. Cover me from what? I'm in the building. Dialogue doesn't make any sense. That was a nice detail. Oh, right, it's just sending me back the way I came. Here, Pierce. This way. Have we got any lights we can turn on? Some torches? It's good you came, Pierce. We should be alright now. We'll link up with the Oval Office detail as soon as we can. You should rejoin them while we're in the clear. Oh, it's a lot of guys. Brilliantly camouflaged by that tent. Oh man, I took that badly. I don't want to die. I'll just crawl inside for a couple of seconds and I'll come back out again. I wonder if I didn't kill anybody in these sections whether the game would advance. But the AI would eventually get bored and just kill everybody. I must say rocket launcher guy's not doing a great job. Ah! Stand still for two seconds! Like that guy. This seems like a bad vantage point. They've got a lot of cover. And we've got this crappy railing. All we've got is the higher ground. Right, I'm waiting for that rocket launcher guy. I want him. <laughs> I just like the fact it doesn't seem to matter where you shoot them with the sniper rifle, they're just dead in one hit. Why did you run out of cover? Into open ground. Just praying I can call a duty shoots people through the wall because there he is. I missed him. Come on. Pop out you bastard. Did I get him?
Maybe I did. Get out of my way! Can't shoot you through your knee. That was a big help. Alright, go back the way we came. That's not the way I came. Back. Was it. Where's the door? Oh, it's Jesus. Uh, any, any cell phones I need to pick up? There's a lot of ammo and weapons just lying around here. What? This is a level that will never end. And will mainly just be me shooting at people in a field. I mean, I'd be tempted to sit here and not do anything, but that wouldn't be great watching. I wonder if I can crawl down in this corner. There we go. Find myself a little spot. Alright, at least I got one of them. Where are you going? <laughs> what? Oh. I burn the van. Where are these guys coming from? They just seem to be spawning in and over and over again. In this empty field. Lots of TV cauldron vans. Um, how many randoms? Are, how big is this army that are fighting us? I've sort of lost the plot as to somebody defected in the Secret Service and tried to assassinate the president, or did assassinate the president and now the vice president. Now we're fighting in a field. I might done over this side, so I need to come help on this side. Because I'm the only Secret Service man who can, apparently. They're all standing in a semicircle. Come on. I see you. Alright, rocket launcher guy is down here somewhere. See his weapon. Just lob a grenade and see what happens. Come on, pop out. I think I got him. I did. This is not the most riveting gameplay experience I've had so far in this game. I'm quite disappointed, like all of the, the cool cutscenes with the the wireframes talking, like those are long gone. 
Where are you going, rocket launcher man? Oh, down here. But I see a leg! Guy up there. Right, we done now? Do you firefight, Pierce? And you're a dead eye. We appreciate the help. The park looks clear, but we'll cover you as far as we can when you head back. You said that last time! You said that last time as well. If I run fast enough, they'll leave me alone. These these voices in my head. Oh God, we're gonna fight in the courtyard again. We're really getting the most out of these environments. Now we're fighting in here again. It's almost like the last 15, 20 minutes never happened. Could you wander over there and do some sniping for a bit? And over there. And back again. Thanks. Explosion. <laughs> I love that their big strategy is everyone is going to run up and hide in a bush. <laughs> this right stick movement is uh, real, real tough. I also feel like some of these guys are not having to reload ever. They're just shooting bullets for days. <laughs> James Hetfield here. <laughs> wow, okay. That really was that level. Hey, the cutscenes are back. Sir, are you alright? Step away from the president! Agent Pierce, what the hell are you doing? I'm gonna ask the VP a few questions, sir. About Costa Centava, about CVX, and about his role in today's events. Move over there. Keep your hands where I can see them, Mr. Vice President. You've lost your mind, Pierce. I don't think so. Did you sign a clearance that circumvents INS jurisdiction to bring citizens into the United States? Yes, but you've been misinformed. Agent Pierce, you are right. There's been covert operations, but not military. We've been trying to reach a diplomatic settlement with Costa Centava over its arms export business for some time. We have radio intercepts and an unauthorized shipment of CVX. The VP brokered a deal with the Costa Centavan government to bring in workers and new exports in exchange for cooperation. Speaker of the House Davies helped with the negotiations. As for CBX, I can assure you the VP was not involved. The President and I have many disagreements over policy, but when it comes to this, we are both emphatic that Centava's arms exports must be stopped. You've got the wrong man, Pierce. If you say so, sir. But the agency has been compromised, and only a high-level authority could... We'll talk about this later, Agent Pierce. Right now, I need every loyal man. What? What the hell was all that about? Oh, yes. This is the president. Sir, my apologies for the intrusion. There is an attack force moving in from the north perimeter. It's a big force, sir. Too big. Identify yourself, caller. I'm working with your agents, sir. The ones who are still yours, anyway. I know who you are. You have direct access to the office of the presidency. Yes, sir, I do. You'll be sufficiently briefed. 
Is he Emperor of the Universe? We'll divert attention. I'll take a couple of Marines to the east wing to draw their fire. Go for the south pad. If you land hard, you'll be in before they even know you're inbound. Sounds like you have a plan, son. Good luck. Is his dad? Does know where the vice president is? I'm here. Your plan is... <laughs> I'm just off camera. I'll leave the diversion. <laughs> the president needs you with him. You're part of the protection. Jim, this isn't necessary. Let the Secret Service handle this. Don't be, uh... We're gonna have to keep agreeing to disagree. It's our public platform, Mr. President. <sighs> that it is, Jim. Good luck, Mr. Vice President. We're gonna do this. We have to move. Why am I talking out the right ear? Back. Ah, well, hell, I bet you'll think of something good to say about me. You're on point, Pierce. I'm right behind you with the President, straight through to the pool house. We need your gun, so watch the gap between us. I'll try to hang back, you try to keep up. Yes. Oh, the frame rate is good in this level. Ooh. What? Why is he running like he's crapped himself? God, there's an achievement in this game for not using the night vision, but Jesus Christ, you'd be hard pressed to do that. Maybe this is one of those games where you have to turn the brightness all the way up. Right, where's where's POTUS? He's hiding behind the bins. We're gonna get the president Objective complete! Trying to move this way, Pierce. We need a bait and switch here. I'll hold back in the pool building with him. You clear the park so we can move again. You'll have to draw all the fire. Open your radio channel. If I hear gunfire on your end, I'll backtrack as fast as I can. I'll call when we're clear. If you mean if we're clear. I said exactly what I mean. There's no if when it comes to this. But <laughs> Magic door. Oh, the techno's kicking in. That means we're in some serious shit now. Yeah, I'll pick up a cell phone. Oh no. Oh, this is not fair. What if the frame rate's better with the uh, infrared on? I heard. Yeah, I'm gonna say I heard footsteps. The AI is actually capable of flanking me. That's not what I was expecting. God damn it! Whoa! Step back, son! What? <laughs> Did he just ragged on and his leg flew out from under him? That was impressive. The highly trained military people with advanced ragdolling. That guy just got back up again. Get back down. Maybe the gravity's different in this level. Nope, nowhere near. I still my sniper rifle. I have. Right. Seems to have gone quiet. Look at this! It's so chunky! This 
This game's run alright so far. I keep thinking he's saying Carlos Santana forever. It's really big fans of Black Magic Woman. And they're willing to fight the President of the United States of America about it. Oh, there. <laughs> What's that noise? Halfway to the LZ, but it's hot as hell. It's a shooting gallery, but I'm doing most of the shooting. Don't move a step with the president yet. Is he all right? He's calm. I don't know if it's optimistic or fatalistic, but I'll take calm either way. We're holding for your all-clear call. We'd make a very good president if he was panicking. Take this game could use some uh, splat and execution bonus points. Some so solid crew. Where's that ammunition? I already picked it up. There it is. It's going to make me go all the way back, isn't it? This game is definitely into backtrack season. Eat grenade. is hot. We have split the detail. I'm coming in from the west alone. You get me airborne and armed. We'll clear the Whoa. remaining hostiles before extracting the president and his escort. Escort, do you copy that? Copy, Pierce. We're watching for you. Roger that. We're coming in hard and fast, Pierce. Machine guns all yours if you can make it to us. Good luck. This game's a lot harder when it's not uh when the frame rate's dropped so much the responsiveness of the controller is not keeping up. Where are you? Shooting into the shadows. Oh. Give me Give me a minute to get my bearings. Wait for him to run at you. That seems to be the solution. I'm getting lucky with some of these headshots. <laughs> Shoot him in the leg. Billy dies. There we go. Whoa! That tree is really getting a lot of bullets at it. Where are you? There you are. See, even with the night vision, I can't tell where these people are. How are you going to bring POTUS through here? I feel like I'm advancing too quickly. I'm going to get ambushed any second. Pierce, we're on the ground. Where are you? I'm also on the ground. Support fire, Marine One. All right. Heavy fire from the east side of the park, and had to swing wide if we wanted to pick you up at all. Fight or flight, you know. This game's mostly a bit about fight. Oh! I'm approaching from the west, Marine One. We see you here. Climb aboard. Guns are ready. Oh, come on. So why is that helicopter there, and there's a bunch of enemies outside? Why can't they help me and shoot them? Well, at least it didn't send me back miles. I'm approaching for the west, Marine One. We see you here. Climb aboard. Guns are ready. Ah, yeah, see. 
Where is he? He's over here somewhere, isn't he? Stop shooting at me! this real weird dead zone in the controls that you so it, it's super slow super slow but that's me rolling the stick around if you hold it it just starts spinning wildly all right are we done we need to clear the area now the Whoa. Loaded. got whiplash from that we're in a helicopter not exactly stealth. You don't have armor? It's not bulletproof. We can't last forever. So try not to take that long. I'm glad we've copied the bit from uh, Call of Duty 4. I was worried we weren't going to get an AC30. AC30? Is an AC30 an amplifier? AC130? Oh, if you thought the aiming was bad before, try a mounted machine gun. Oh, look at this physics! Everyone's flying up in the air. Woo! Wee! It's flying up as high as the tree. Anything to do? Other than stare at that quite sad American flag that looks like it's flickering out. Where are they? Whoa! So powerful it's destroyed the frame rate. Three benches. At least there appears to be no cooldown on the uh, mountain machine gun. Are they going to be rocket launcher people as well? I spot hostiles. Let's clear out the area. Where? Oh. Coming over the wall. You got a beat on them? I've got a feeling like we're doing this again. Is there always three benches? This is the most inaccurate. I feel like I'm just painting the ground with bullets. And it doesn't help that the frame rate doesn't hold up when you hold the uh, trigger in.
Well, that's that done. <laughs> Where's he gonna start me? Okay. The hostiles are not on their way out, they're already out. Promise, I can't. This feels totally trial and error because I've got no idea where any of these guys are. Please no more rocket launcher guys. Yay! Have to. Yes, sir. Changing course. Air Force Command. Correction, Marine One. This is Vice President French. Negative on that extraction. We're drawing so much fire here. I'm not, I'm not getting out alive. Jim, we're coming for you. Sit tight until. Good luck with the, with the future, Mr. President. Jim! Jim, are you there? Jim! Standing by for orders, Mr. President. We gave up on Jim, and that's the end of that. Jim is no longer. <laughs>